going on everybody thanks for tuning in some more star wars for you and a little bit of padim now this stuff again has been like selling like crazy even common bulk has been selling like crazy i can't get over it i'm not sure when this video is going to drop to be honest i have a, a lot of back i have more videos than i have time to post at the moment so uh, i've been cracking a lot of product lately and um which is a good thing, uh, but I just need to, you know, work through some of those videos. So I'm not sure when this is going to post, not sure when the pricing is going to be done on the videos. We're going to get a nice little thumb shot there. And we're going to just talk about the Star Wars market here because things are nuts at the... Ooh. Now, that's what you want to see, but you want to see it in showcase. Hoth, wilderness fighter, mercenary. Um, like I said, even common bulk is selling like it is absolutely crazy we got rook and the bounty hunter crew for our uh hyper foil we're calling it hyper foil now hyper foil and i can't i can't get over it i can't get over how well bulk's doing i can't get over how well the uh the whole market in general is on this i'm gonna be actually playing some of this tomorrow along with a little bit of commander and a little bit of sorcery so i'm excited to do that um there we go gladiator star destroyer excited to do that and uh excited to watch some box openings myself on this and and you know be the be the person on the other side of the table for once um watching some openings we got the technician repair it's hard to get this product i actually got this in at 105 and current prices are between 135 to 140 and uh, i placed an order with this just as kind of like things were ticking up command boom legendary one boom gideon oh that's a pack so we got at the moment at the moment and everybody's gonna say your prices are wrong at the moment command is going for ten dollars at the moment and uh Gideon Hask hyperspace foil, I imagine it's probably somewhere around 15 for something, hyperfoil, sorry, 15 for something like that, because we got a rare hyperfoil. You heard it on this channel, folks, first we're calling it hyperfoil. You can pin it and come back in the future when everybody's calling it hyperfoils. Subscriber made a comment in one of my other videos, and I'm like, I love it. Hyperfoil all day. Boom. Um, protector, Chewbacca, pray for takeoff. Oh boy, there we go. There's a $15 card coming in. I had no choice foil on that. That's a couple bucks. Okay. All right, we had a couple packs here where we're doing pretty well. Love to see a hyper foil re legendary, though. That would be really exciting. Resilient, Jawa. Power fail. Oh, boop, boop, boop. Sorry, sorry. Power fail. And power of the dark side. Boom. Count Dooku. He's about two or three bucks at the moment. It really doesn't like him. And a Cornelian freighter. Well, the paper packs. Fighting me more. Capital City. What do we got? What do we got? Common. Okay. Bib, Mon Moth. Oh boy, hyper, hyperspace K S, K two S O, and a seventh sister, which is also a pretty nice, uh, pretty nice hit. I don't even know what this is going for in hyper, hyperspace. My guess is probably around nineteen or so, at the moment. But that's a good one you want to see. And seventh sister is also a couple bucks. So we're we're lining up our our money. Pretty nice. Director. Vanquish. Pathfinder. The ghost. Ooh, a governor. We've had some nice pulls in this so far. A lot of value up there. A lot of value. Guardian. What do we got? What do we got? ATST. What do we got? 
and a Blizzard Assault ATAT. Admiral Akbar, a drop. Do you want to buy some death sticks? You don't want to sell me death sticks. I don't want to sell you death sticks. You want to go home and change your life. I want to go home and change my life. Boba Fett again. Bamboozle. Boom! Rebel Assault. Okay. Wolf. Okay. And an Admiral. Holy cow, is that annoying. My computer just restarted on me. Left uh, pretty much the same spot. Picked up where we left off. Um, just on this pack here. And still some pop-ups are coming up. I'm, I'm doing too many recordings. Too many record. It doesn't like all of those. What do we got? Command Center. Metal. Surgical. Disarm. Force throw. Shoot first. Fallen lightsaber. That's a couple bucks. And do we not have a hyper space in that pack? I am very confused about this. Very confused. Oh, boom. Administrator's tower. We got a hyper foil coming in. Recruit. Soldier. Race. Bright hope. Sorry, that's a uncommon force joke die advanced and boom chopper he's about a buck 50 and recruit okay the common hyperfoils are very common i've noticed i've noticed it's it's like very often i pull common hyperfoil so I, I think that the rarity stands in that slot what do we got here recruit again Boom, boom, boom. I had no choice. And an Av Avenger foil. Boom. Okay, in the foil slot there. Avenger's a legendary, and uh, it's not crazy pricey. It's like 10 bucks or so in the non-foil. A um, little, little bit of damage on the top up there. I don't know if you guys can uh, see that from the, from the cutting machines. But I will always take a foil legendary. I don't care what legendary it is. An interesting thing, too, is as new sets come out, like, will you see spikes on some of those other legendaries? Will you see dips on some? Like, it'll be very interesting to see, you know, as meta changes, what becomes rare and what kind of goes by the wayside. Overwhelming barrage, and it binds all things. Guardian. So far, this is a pretty decent box, given that we haven't hit any of the major legendaries or a, you know, a showcase or anything crazy. Death Trooper. Forced Surrender. The Force is with me. Bendu. He's a buck or two. Homestead Militia. I don't know how I feel about the 24-pack booster packs, uh, booster boxes. I don't know how I feel about that, to be honest. But it is what it is. Make me a opening. Mm, overwhelming. Bit, uh, Force lightning. Boom. Legendary. That's a nice, uh, nice hit right there. Forget what it's going for, but it's pretty decent. A lieutenant. Um, I want to say it's, it was in the 20s last time because it's just a, it's a good card. Just, just too good. Check out my website, too. You know, I have good deals on eBay that I find and try to share out on the website for you folks. Um, I got some pack openings on the, for the channel if you want to be a part of that. And uh, if you want to do some Star Wars on the channel, let me know. And check out some gear. I got some gear going on down in the description if you want to look at that. Um, I've been working on a lot of things lately for the channel. been searching a lot of those feelings. And uh, pulled out some, some upgrades. So... I want to get into slotting. I, guys, I'm going to be starting to do some TCG player uh, videos on just like how I sell, what my what my um, you know strategies are, how much volume I do, how much. Speaking of, like, how much volume do you guys think I do on TCG player? Leave a comment down below. How many cards, on average? I love this art. Do I sell 
in one week on TCG Player. <laughs> oh, no way. No way. No way. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is like money pull right here. It's not a foil, but holy cow. Jeez, this, I mean, this pays for the booster box right here. This is like more than the booster box. Um, I don't, I don't even know where to begin. That one's probably not being sold. I'm going to Timmy that one. Oh my God. Oh my God. But yeah. How many do you think I sell on TCG player in a, in a week? Comment down below. Um, you might be surprised. You might be surprised. Uh, some of the smart folks might go out and do some analytics on my uh, on my shop and you know see what see what comes of it. <laughs> Another legendary. Oh my god. How is this possible? Sometimes we have like no legendaries and then sometimes we're pulling them like crazy. Change of hearts like another ten dollar card. It's nothing crazy. Holy cow. But I want to start doing some tutorials. I may even start offering some memberships where, like, if you're interested in selling on TCG Player, I may do, like, weekly sessions with folks to answer questions and share best practices and do special content um, just related to selling on TCG Player. Um, I've had a surprising number of folks interested in that content, and... Um, like I said, oh, energy, it's about two bucks or so, two, three bucks. Uh, I've had a surprising number of folks interested, and I'd kind of like to do that. I think it would be an interesting prospect because um, I, I, I can share my strategies. Okay. Oh, we got a hyperfoil coming in. If it's another legendary, this box was just, like, wild. What do we got? Rallying Cry, Ghost, Compartment. Jabba the Hut coming in for a couple bucks, five or so, and maximum firepower. Nothing crazy there. Okay. Boom. Academy. Disarm. We got the Snow Trooper. What do we got here? ATST. Okay, smoke and cinders for a couple bucks, and there's our defense walker again. Okay, we got three packs left. Comment down below. Would you be interested in joining? Are you somebody that likes to sell on TCG Player? And when I say I do volume on TCG Player, I fulfill something to the effect of 50,000 orders a year. 50,000 orders a year. So what do you think 50,000 orders looks like in terms of storage you know organization how does that look and you can go out and, and check you know on, on tcg player check out my shop i'm doing that volume you can see on bib bombing run that's a couple bucks and a governor governor coming in foil rare okay two packs left this has been an excellent box i mean those two hyper hyperspace right there, jeez. I mean, we've had several, four other uh, legendary pulls, five total legendary. Like this has just been a great box. Glad to share it with you all. Power of the Dark Side, General Quarrel for a buck or so, and an escort. Very final pack. Thanks for joining. Remember, like for me, folks. Give me those likes. I, I get some dislikes because it's Star Wars products. So if you like Star Wars, if you like the opening, you know, give me those likes to help controverse some of those uh, dislikes because there's a lot of a lot of folks are are angry with Star Wars. They don't want to see it do well. They don't want to see it do well, Colonel. All right, and let's take a look at this Vader one more time because that is wild. And with that, talk to you all later. Blah, <laughs>